The Olympics produce new heroes every day, but here's one Olympian who's become an overnight internet sensation and the world can't keep calm. We are talking about Turkish shooter Yusuf Dikec, whose silver medal win at the Paris Olympics is stuff not only of dreams, but also movies and web series, some might say. In an Olympic competition where participants use all the available equipment at their disposal to get ahead, Dikec stunned everyone as he offered a masterclass in nonchalance during the air pistol mixed team competition on Tuesday. While his opponents took to the competition with specialized equipment, custom glasses to obscure vision in one eye, large ear protection and tinted lenses, believe it or not, Dikech managed to claim Turkey's first ever Olympic medal in shooting in what looked like his everyday glasses and one hand in his pocket. You heard that right, no protective equipment or eye gear. None whatsoever. And guess what? He's 51 years old. Yusuf Dikec told a Turkish radio station, I shoot with both eyes. Most shooters do it with one. So I didn't want all that equipment. Shooting with two eyes, I believe it's better. I've done a lot of research on it, so I didn't want that equipment. Shooting with my hand in one pocket has nothing to do with any artistry. I'm more motivated and feel more comfortable while shooting. And that stance is actually about bringing the body to equilibrium and focusing and concentrating. As we said, ever since his images went viral, the internet can't stop raving about this Olympian and his aura. He's also become the subject of a meme fest on social media. One social media user said, top confidence, a hand in one pocket, no specialized lenses, no problem, too easy for him. Another lauded his insane aura. Someone else wrote, at 51 years old, he competed in the Olympic Games as if he were on the patio at his home. After securing the silver, Dikesh said, I'm happy. An Olympic medal is an Olympic medal and in Los Angeles, which is going to host the 2028 Games, hopefully it will be a gold medal.